Yo, what is good, yo? It's your boy Ty back here with another video. And in this video today, we are going to be doing glitched point guard Monte Ellis gameplay. Before we go any further, huge shout out to my guy Cheap Loots for letting me hop on his account to record this video. If you are new to my channel and have not yet, please smash that subscribe button. As we're on the road to 35,000 subscribers, looking at Monte here, 6'3, 185 pounds. He does have a 6'2 wingspan, which is very concerning to me. 88 three ball, 98 driving dunk, comes with an 86 ball handle, 86 steel, 82 perimeter defense, 95 speed, speed ball acceleration, 98 vertical with an 88 lateral quickness. Tendency wise, Monte Ellis does come with 100 driving dunk tendency. Let's see what his defensive tendencies are like. Does have a 72 on ball steal as well as a 68 pass interception tendency. Looking at the badge, five Hall of Famers on next gen, including fearless finisher, acrobat, highlight film, post rider, post riser and giant slayer i think he comes with more hall of fame badges if i am correct on current gen 23 gold badges including catch and shoot difficult shots pickpocket big dodger anti-freeze hot shot rhythm shooter slurry finisher bailout downhill handers for days quick first step space creator tight handles dead eye sniper green machine tireless shooter volume shooter six silver badges corner specialist ankle breaker break starter circus threes deep threes and data threader with bronze clamps and diamond now all of those badges can be upgradable so you can get him gold deep threes and clamps and you know i'm guessing he has those five badge spots let's see he does have five badge spots as well so if you're looking to bad what badges should you apply to a monte ellis card i mean total in all badges he can max out at 41 badges i would maybe look to get him maybe hot zone hunter uh, a badge like blinders is a decent badge intimidator interceptor heart crusher those are some other badges that you might be interested in putting on monte ellis we are on next gen so that's going to impact kind of what monte ellis looks like and his dribble six so we'll see this is the this is the curry escape he comes with i don't know i don't know how i feel about this i mean really to be honest with you um but that's his curry escape right there let's see momentum behind the back i mean it is what it is let's see let's see it's just normal behind the back okay i don't mind those dribble six that much in the full court now obviously in the half court i don't know how he's gonna move where that's what i'm here to, to kind of find out how is he gonna move in the half court uh and that's what i'm here to show you guys hot spots for everywhere besides that right hash which i per oh my gosh like this game look at how hard they dribble the ball like it's absolutely ridiculous Like, you guys see how hard they dribble the ball? It's absolutely crazy how hard they can dribble the ball. And I don't know, like, the speed boost is okay. Monte Ellis, I like his release. Look, I don't know. That's the first thing I noticed with the card. It's not his dribble sigs. It's nothing like that. It's his release. His release is super quick, super butter. Now, this is on next gen. I don't know what exactly what it looks like on current gen. But what I can say is on next gen, his release is knocked down. Like, it is absolutely knocked down. Now, I'm trying to think of whatever. It kind of reminds me of the Tony Parker release of last year. If y'all remember, that's kind of the quickness and everything that it reminds me of. Now, it's, I'm not going to sit here and say it's like base 98 because it's not that quick or anything like that. But it just kind of did just the way he shoots the ball reminds me of how kind of Tony Parker shot the ball last year. But it is absolutely knocked down. I absolutely love this release on Monte Ellis. Let's see. Green another one. Oh yeah, his release is absolute butter. Let's see if I can if I can dribble a little bit in the half court with him. Like I'm just not good at dribbling as a whole, and that's something right now. Obviously, I'm going to work to improve, but right now I'm just I'm not a very good dribbler. I'll be the first to admit it. I got a long way to go. But the fact that Monte Ellis can do that is incredible. I mean, just the fact that he's 6'3 and can do that type of a move, that's wild to me. He's gonna be dunking on everybody, and honestly. He is going to be a John Stockton clone. The one thing I will say is at least on next gen, give me Monte Ellis's release over John Stockton every day of the week. Now on current gen, Stockton's release is a little bit quicker. On next gen, it's slowed down a little bit. With Monte Ellis, his release is super quick, super green, and I'm excited to use him in my team unlimited. I'm super, super excited to use Monte Ellis. Now I don't, is this, be, oh, it's cause, is it because of my team colors? I never really noticed this energy bar thing before. Monta Ellis just Monta Ellis just cooked him. Uh, he really did. On the first best of the game, he absolutely cooked him. Obviously, I turned the ball over, whatever. But he cooked him. He fried him like a piece of bacon. Good defense. Keep jumping to him. That's a good possession. All right, we got a good shot on the first possession. So Monte, let's go crazy, my boy. Hey. 
Hey. What in the world was that? I don't know. That's not even what I tried doing. I just wanted a quick stop. I shot a moving three, but he did get it to go good. I love his speed on the defensive end, too. I absolutely love the speed. Good. Look at the rotation out of the corner by Grant Hill. We could pull up on the break. Oh, you guys know. You guys know what I was setting up for. Woo! Look at Monte on top of the defender right there. Let's go. Good defense. Rotate. Rotate. We're here. Good. We're here. Good. We're here. Good to Rosen board. Look at Monte. Run. Hey. Somebody better stop me. Somebody better stop me. Nobody does good things. Zion saved him from another slam dunk. That's a tough take. I'm going to tell you, Monte Ellis isn't bad on defense. Like, you can't sit here and try to expose him on the defensive end because he's pretty Perfect. good on defense. And let me tell you something about his release as well on the offensive end. I'm loving this card already. Look at the defense. Get on the... Look at the hustle. He needs to be rewarded. He needs to be rewarded. He is another green light for Monte Ellis. Good, Monte. To the cup. Getting a dunk. Tim is fine in there. I'm not... Ah, oh, I got stuck on a screen, man. Good run. Uh-oh. I should have just let it fly. Back to him. Come here. Yo, why am I getting double team? Back to him. Come here. You know what I do with Tim Duncan. I love Tim Duncan. I always love Tim Duncan. Oh, my goodness. We gave up a wide open shot. That is a little deep, though. Ron Monte up to DeRozan. DeRozan with a two-handed jam, and we are up 18-2. to two. Ray Rock. Yo, he just, that's great defense. I'm not going to sit here and lie. He dodged me, but we had the next rotation coming. Monte, has he to the cup? He has takeover, no foul, ref? Come on, man. He got hacked. Run, Monte. Somebody better stop me on the break, though. Nobody stops me on the break. He doesn't even have gold range. It's only silver. But silver's enough if you have a release as good as his. Drop. Woo! Look at the swings. Look at Monte. Uh-oh. Somebody better pick me up. Somebody better pick me up. It's fine. It's fine. Patience, right? Patience, patience, patience. Patience. Early, that's my fault. I gotta green it, man. Thank you. You are Come so again. baited. I'm sorry. Like that is baited right there. Stop it on the break. That might be a little too deep, but nothing's too deep for Monte Ellis here in this first quarter. He's got 19 of our 24 points. You know, there's a mode called domination. I mean, I get. I know domination might be harder for you. But, 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 t -t today, Junior, when you're growing up against Monte Ellis, it's not going to matter. Stay, yes, DeRozan. Uh-oh. His release is just so butter. Oh, my word. We get a quit at the start of the second quarter. We saw what Monte did in Unlimited. Let's see what he does in a triple threat online. Happen in here to a triple threat online game. Who am I seeing? Charlie Ward. Is that who I see? Well, Monte just cooked him. He just cooked him. I, I got to learn how to set my feet better. Chill, come here. Set your feet. It is, it is crazy how good his release is. I didn't even want to shoot that. I honestly didn't even want to shoot it, but I'll take it. Nice mid-range pull-up for Monte right there. Good defense. Oh, yeah. Now we're getting bumpy. I like the defense. I like the defense. Yup. I like the defense. Give me my steal, 2K. I love the defense, Monte. Keep doing your thing, man. Keep doing your thing, Monte. Keep doing your thing. Where we at? Get him the rock. Chill.
Attack the rim. Monte Ellis attacking the rim. A two-handed jam. Yeah. I don't know what it is. I'm more comfortable moving around screens with Monte Ellis than about anybody in the game on next gen. I mean, it's that, that's just what it is. Now, I don't know current gen how good he is. I'm going to have to go and try him on current gen. But on next gen, he is just absolutely ridiculous. Like, he greens every single shot. I like basically every open I've taken with him has been green and I'm not that consistent of a shooter So that's just how impressive Monte Ellis is run to the rim Look he uh, he can do it all. I don't know what else there is to say what else there is to do Monte Ellis my man Good board Yes, sir run chill hmm. The only time he missed is when he got a lightly. That's it. Oh my gosh. Pulling up a heavy. That's fine. Back to him. We're good. Chill. That's just very good defense. He just absolutely boxed me on that possession. But he just played good defense. I shot three shots with Monte. All of them were contested. All right, I see slashing takeover though, so no, don't the, the last possession doesn't even bother me a little bit because I see slashing takeover. What's Big Z got to stop? Yo, I've missed four straight shots with Monte. All of them have been lightly or heavy. All right, it's a tie game, and it's not it's not like I'm playing bad. It's just I haven't gotten as good of sh shots with Monte lately as I did early in the game. Come here. That's about how oh, I'm starting to miss shots with him. It's a bad sign. It's a bad sign. Just blow by him. Blow by him. Get me a dunk. And then we'll, we'll move and groove on to the next possession. I need to see a shot go through the hoop, though. Show me. Show me, Charlie Ward. Show me. Look at Monte. Hey. Walk back. Walk back. Oh, yeah. Just watch out. Just watch out, y'all. Just watch out. I got Big Z on me. Hey, hey, hey. I got Big Z on me. What? There's no way. Is that a straight arm? Like, is that a straight arm or is it me? I got to know, 2K. Because earlier, I wasn't missing anything with him. And now, all of a sudden, I'm missing everything. It doesn't make sense to me. T-Mac, that's a stop. Thank you. Give me a board, though. Oh, my gosh. I'm going to lose to Big Z. Yeah, I hate to see it. Come here. You can't leave him, guys. I promise you, you can't leave him. Finally, I get rewarded for getting an open shot, which I have basically all game. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Yeah, I hate to see it. my opponent. Yeah, I hate to see it. Monte Ellis, I think, scored all of my points. Looking at the box score, it's kind of deceiving. Obviously, he scored 21 points, and the field goal percentage and three-point percentage wasn't that good. But trust me when I say it was my fault by taking heavies and lightlies. On next gen, give me Monte Ellis over John Stockton. Give me over John Wall. Give me him over Darren Williams. Honestly, give me him over every other auctionable point guard in the NBA 2K21. If you can get this card for under 200K, it's not a bad price. Do I think you can get him for cheaper than that? Absolutely, and that's what I would try to do. But guys, this Monte Ellis card is just different. He's just different. That's all I can say. I think a good price point is about that 150 price point. That's where I think you guys can possibly get him for. Maybe even cheaper because it does look like he is pretty flooded on the auction house. So just kind of stay tuned if, if you can get him for cheaper. Obviously, do that. If you can find one that's badged out, that's definitely recommended as well. But guys, trust when I say on next gen specifically, Monte Ellis is a top three point guard in NBA 2K21. My team, comment your thoughts on Monte or any other players that we got today down below. Guys, drop a like on the video. Subscribe if you are new. And as always, man, I love you guys and have a blessed day.